In this video, we're going to talk about what bed bugs look like so you can know whether what you're looking at is a bed bug or it is something else. Hey, this is Jeremy from Bed Bugs Banished where I help you get rid of all the bed bugs in your home so you can sleep in peace again. Hey, and if you like this video, be sure to subscribe. I click the link below and hey, get your free 30 minutes so you can talk to me and I can help you get rid of all the bed bugs in your life. All right, let's go. So what do bed bugs look like? Well, bed bugs are small, flat, reddish brown insects that belong to the family Semicidae. That's like the um, Latin, whatever uh, name. They have a distinctive appearance that can help you identify them. So here's what we're gonna look at, right? Some detailed descriptions of what a bed bug looks like. So the size. Bed bugs are small. They are small. Adult bed bugs are quite small. They're about four to five millimeters in length. The size is comparable to the seed of an apple. So that's quite small. The shape. Why do bed bug shapes, what are they like? Bed bugs have an oval shaped body with a flattened appearance. This shape allows them to easily hide in cracks and crevices. One of the reasons why bed bugs are so hard to find and see that they know how to hide because of their body that is shaped in this like flattened oval thing. All right, what about their color? The color of bed bugs can vary depending on how old they are and whether they have recently fed. When a bed bug is not fed, it has a light tan or straw colored, while bed bugs that have fed on blood are darker, taking on a reddish brown hue, and that's because of the blood that is in the bed bug's body. Now, when they're uh, smaller, too. They like they look more of a like light tan, almost like trans translucent colors. Sort of a, you, you can sort of see through their body. What about their body segmentation? What is that like? Bed bugs have three main body parts: the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. They don't have any wings. Bed bugs don't fly, but they do have six legs and a prominent antenna. You know, like long ones up here. All right, and what about the antenna? The antenna of bed bugs are segmented and are about half the length of their body. They use these antenna of bed, the antenna to sense their environment and locate potential hosts. So they use them to find you. They have mouth parts. Bed bugs have piercing, sucking mouth parts that they use to extract blood from their hosts. That's how they suck your blood. These mouth parts are situated beneath their head. Now there are some distinctive features, right? One of the distinguishing features of adult bed bugs is the presence of horizontal stripes or bands across their back. These stripes might be more noticeable in well-fed bed bugs when they're big and long. Not this, not this big, about, about that big. <laughs> All right. After feeding, after feeding on blood, their bodies become engorged and swollen. They, this changes their shape and their color. They can increase in size by as much as 50% after feeding. Now, how do they move? Bed bugs move relatively slowly and they tend to avoid light. They like the dark places. They are skilled at hiding in cracks crevices, seams of mattresses, and other concealed spots near their hosts. And then bed bugs also look different depending on wh where they are in their life cycle. So the life cycle of a bed bug is the stages, you know, that a bed bug goes from like being an egg to being a nymph, which is the name for a small bed bug, to being an adult bed bug. So young bed bugs called nymphs have a similar shape to adults but are smaller and lighter in color. As nymphs grow and molt, they become darker and larger until they reach adulthood. So that is what bed bugs look like. We used to have bed bugs, and if you are struggling with bed bugs right now, you have tried everything, 
you know and nothing is working, make sure you click the link below so I can give you some tips for how you can completely, permanently get rid of the bed bugs from your home. Click the link below, you get a free 30 minute conversation with me and I help you get rid of bed bugs. Look, I've been there. I struggled with bed bugs for, for over one year, but now we're completely bed bug free. So hey, take advantage of this. Click the link below so you can talk to me. Plus, I will also send you the eight steps that my family and I took to completely get rid of the bed bugs. You're gonna want that. All right, click the link below and I'll see you soon. Make sure you also watch these two videos here and uh, I'll see you soon. All right, shalom.